monies have been paid and $58 million spent already on, on this project site, compensation paid to people who own buildings on this site. Not yet paid. And some of them even not yet paid because yeah. there are some that are already in court. Dr. Bwachi Dankwa, who has to account for this? Because Shraj says this contract is illegal right from the beginning. Good morning to you and good morning to your viewing public. And um, I know that as part of the program and the conversation, we'll have time to talk a lot more about the legacy president, president and another Dankwe Kufuado. And so um, yeah. I would hold on to that and um, deal with the cathedral issue. I've, I've read the Shirai report. I am minded to consider some of the issues that they have raised, um, particularly on the call for extended forensic. But I think that as a people, it's, it's important that we remain continually transparent and continually open and accountable to the Ghanaian people. I'm very certain that it's been the greatest desire of every Ghanaian to have seen the completion of a national cathedral as a place of worship for all of us. Be it as it may, it has not become a reality as we speak now. And so I would hold on to wait to see that some of the issues that have been raised by the requisite constitutional body, which is charge, would be attended to in, in the few days that are left. And um, to hold a lot more brief and integrity for um, the men of God, whom a sizable part I know very personally, and have engaged also very personally on this project, whom have shared their own concerns as well with me. And uh, to state that the real truth really, as um, the forensics come out, would be made bare for all of us to know. And I know that the 2020 accounts have already been audited and they are working on the 2021 account. And so my comments would be very brief on the cathedral but really to state that um, full accountability should be made bare and if there's a forensic that has to be done for everyone to really know what the amount of money that has been pumped into the cathedral has really been used for because it's not meet for purpose in terms of what we're all expecting to see now you talk about the accountability of the money that has been spent so far on it at least we know the breakdown of the 58 million dollars because that, that that's public that's public knowledge, right? And the fact that as we speak, the cathedral site, in fact, we, we, we've been there this morning, so viewers should stay with us. I'm gonna show you the latest state of the cathedral site as of this morning, 7.45 a.m., just some 40 minutes ago. We were there, so we'll show it to you. Uh, that place is heavily guarded but uh, our investigative journalists were able to get uh, the videos of the cathedral site why, as of today. But it's, 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 the place is heavily guarded. We, we have security men all over the place guarding the site because said it is not open for, for, for the public. Yes. That's, yeah, that's but, what... But, but why are they still guarding the place? I mean, the last time I went there, I saw some security men there too. But so now they don't want us to see what is there. They, why? It's standard. Construction site. You just need security. Yeah. They said heavily guarded. No, it's not. But they are not constructing it. It's a construction. There can be any casualties. You see, this is a fail. Don't overstretch. We should overstretch. It's a construction site. It's a construction site. Is there something being constructed there? No, but it's a construction site. No, no. But what is that? Don't overstretch it. Are you still saying Cathedral and ABC? I have not made a statement. Okay, okay, no, no, but no, so okay, if, right, if, right, if right. it is not, if it is not, don't, 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 if, if they are still not constructed, you, should, you, should you, just, don't, don't, you know how much we are spending on all of that security and all of that? Decommission the thing. Dr. People Dr. should, should go. Stop, should, stop paying people should, every month. Let, let, let me have Dr. Watt Dangwa conclude. Should, should, with the state of affairs, hold on. Hold on. The trees, bring back the trees. Hold on. The trees that you And stop paying people every month. Dr. Watt Dangwa, with the details of this report, as you have seen, should this project continue? And should we keep paying people every month? No. 
You, no, 31 no, no, months okay. of no work done. I, I want to hear from him. Including the man of God. I want to hear from you. So is he answer? No, no, no. Hold on. 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 Uh, you are the spokesperson on governance and mm -hmm. security. Yes, I am. Your, your opinion matters. Yes, I can share my opinion, but it's not my call to make whether the project should continue. In your or not. opinion, should this project continue? As a Ghanaian? No, of course. I mean, I, I don't know. Have you have you joined the co-hosting, Prof? <laughs> I mean, we are co-hosting. Oh, you're co-hosting. We are co-hosting. We are co-hosting. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, I didn't know that. Hold on. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. So it's it's almost it's almost all of you and me. Oh no. Hold on. 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 Hold so no. you see, Alfred, it's not it's not my call to make whether the project should go on or not. But um, as as a Ghanaian, as a public servant, as a politician, it's it's important that we are all very open and very transparent in accounting to the Ghanaian people on how we have used public funds. And one of the things that I always say when I say that let's not overstretch the issues is that there there are very good sides of President Nanado Danko Kufu those governors with um, the utilization of the funds that has been made available for a lot of infrastructural projects. I mean, just even next to the cathedral, you see um, the law house, the number of infrastructural projects that has been done. And I do not want us to overstretch this issue um, of, of the National Cathedral. Um, Shraj has brought their report out. They mm -hmm. have made recommendations. They have asked that a forensic be done, uh, which was also asked by some eminent members of the board of trustees as well. And uh, we would want to see that, yes, these forensics um, would be done so that we can clearly appreciate the issues very well. And like I've stated, I mean, it would have been the desire of the other Ghanaian people, including myself, um, as a practicing Christian, that this cathedral would have been done and um, completed with, so we can have a place of worship. But like I said, it is not our desire has not been met by by the very limiting challenges that we have now, and so we would only um, have to wait a lot more. Um, I'm not sure the construction can continue with all the issues that are arising um, as we speak now. Um, but yes, we would, we would wait for the forensic to come out so that we can know how these funds have been used and for the purposes of it. So, if your candidate wins, and this is a question. Coming in from one of uh, our viewers, says if your candidate wins, which you are supporting him, would you want this National Cathedral project to be built? You know, I'll tell you the truth. When Al Haji Dr. <coughs> Mahmoud Bamiya is declared the president elect um, in the next few days, I am very certain that there's going to be a remodeling um, of the concept. Um, I'm very certain that there's going to be a lot more um, thought processes as it relates to. Um, the issues that have happened um, with the cathedral. Um, I'm very certain that, um, yes, forensics obviously would be done for, for the Ghanaian people to be able to know how far we have come. And um, if there is a way of redoing it in a smaller scale, smaller okay, scale, that would be able to meet up. I mean, so I'm just giving my ideas in terms of. You mean um, this current what, one is flamboyant? It's too, too, too huge? Uh, no. you, asked, you asked my opinion, mm -hmm. you know. So um, on a smaller scale, so that we can be able to, because you see, um, you know, Alfred, I've, I've traveled quite a bit and I've seen a lot of cathedrals around the world. I've seen basilicas around the world. You know, at, at, at some stages, right, a place of worship is a place where you feel that God is present. Mm -hmm. And so even here in TV3, you can have a place of worship and say that this is a place where God is present. 
and it, it it can be a very small place if you go to israel and you go to the various synagogues and the temples they are okay. not in that magnitude okay mm -hmm. so um i'm very certain that there's going to be a remodeling a reconceptualization of it um and then a real look at a number of things um, in that regard when i'll you dr mahmoud baumia wins but there have been calls for causing financial loss to the state to be to be slapped on some persons on this matter including the president president Kufuado because of the amount of money that has been spent on this 58 million dollars so far and all the monies that we're having to pay for compensation would you support that the courts must be able to bring that out um it can be it can be a call that comes from individuals but there must be a court that um, will splash that on on an individual that yes based on your actions and inactions you have caused financial loss to the state i mean it's not um just the opinion of what people say but a court a court should be able to bring that out well, well, uh, 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 I'll come to you. I, 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 I don't, I don't, I don't <laughs> understand why. <laughs> that, as I indicated, when one of our investigative journalists got to the cathedral site as of 7.45 a.m. this morning, he was denied entry because of the security at the place. But yet, we were able to get some videos of the current state of the Nasa Cathedral site. So what you're seeing on the screen right now are the videos that our investigative journalists captured as of 7.45 a.m. this morning. So there you have it um, right now. There's nothing happening. It, the place is overgrown with weeds. A um, number of the construction equipment, in fact, no, they've been taken off site. So does that mean that the, construction, the contractor, the block has parked away from the site? Yes, you remember two years ago, I published a letter the contractor wrote to all staff that they are mitigating costs. So mm. the uh, staff should go home and uh, await further instructions. So the, the contractor left site 31 months ago. 31 months ago. Yeah, and so yet, and yet, whilst you see, you see the difference between the private person and then the public officials. The private person, Rebade, mm -hmm. has quickly asked their staff to go home and they are not paying them. However, government of Ghana, on our part, our taxes are being used to pay the National Cathedral Secretariat staff every month. Mm -hmm. And I have published unimpeachable, incontrovertible payment slips on this matter. Every month they are being paid. So what you're saying, there's a current state of the cathedral site project. And this is not, um, it's not a mini forest or anything. It's just uh, this uh, cathedral site has been overgrown with weeds, with all of these uh, uh, structures you see there, wooden structures. $58 million. And you say the, the amount spent on this so far is what, $58 million? Is that million. The 50, yeah, $58 million. The construction When people cost. are building... My, hospitals. My, what's, Recently, what's you saw the thing? UPSA giant hostel that they, they commissioned. $16 million. I see. There's nothing so, there. So what yeah. did they used to do? Yeah. Did they, what did you, they you, have, you have people, like, people like Kari Summers, mm -hmm. who is keeping our $6 million mm -hmm. out of the $58 million. And I they, 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 yeah, they said he's going to raise funds. Mm -hmm. Ajay, Ajay gave uh, $61 million, yeah, Ghana, right? Yeah. Ajay took over $20 million. Yeah. So, well, uh, on this... The dollar on equivalent. The, yeah, yeah. Hey. Yes. Well, hey, so just, 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 for, just, for, just for the... Restaurant. The restaurant. 5.7 5. million yes. dollars. Uh, but the yeah. main one, because out of... Well, I thought there's 61 million Ghana. If we convert, is that how much we are looking at? No, that's as, as of the prevailing rate at the time. At uh, the time. Yes, yeah. that's about five, five cities, 50% oh. or so. So that's the, the current state of the cathedral site.